What's up guys, it's Ricky and on this particular video I wanted to talk shortly about the removal of the interview videos uh, with CCSBC. You guys would remember that when I made those videos, I did mention there were a promo run around the same time for the BBC. The BBC guys had talked to me and said, hey, we're bringing out this. And so the day before we did an interview, we recorded, we edited, and then we had the videos out. So those videos were literally promo material for that documentary. Now, those videos are not there. You might go to the videos and you'll see blank pictures. I'll also explain why I do that on all my video, on some of the videos actually. And so I've explained it before. It's not a mystery. <laughs> okay? I, I, when I remove a video, I don't just make it go away. No? You will be able to see that there was a video here. It is no longer there. I don't hide that I removed the video. I don't do that. And so there is a reason why I do that. There's a reason why I also tell others not to do that, not to just remove a video. But on this particular video, I want to explain why did I remove the video. I want to give you a verse for something we, me and you should look out for and be careful about. And so the direct reality show would do daily Christian commentary videos. And so I removed the videos because uh, there was a certain narrative that was running around the BBC documentaries, videos. And so, and also, by the way, the reason why I'm making this video right now is that Sisse posted a video about the passing of her daughter. And so I'll leave that video in the description if you want to go watch it. I haven't watched it, so I don't know what she's saying there. And so I think she just posted it like a few hours. I don't have lights right now. I'm using phones. You can see in order to create a front a main light and a headlight and so and i'm using the power uh, the small power station to power the camera and so i'm making this video now because she is now talking about it so i thought okay since she's talking about the person or the daughter let me come out and make a video and explain why i removed the videos first of all why did i not just it, the videos are not completely deleted you just see it's like five seconds left or something like that. The reason for that, I've explained it's an algorithm reason. Uh, when you remove the video completely, you delete the data that the video holds. And so the people that watched, the watch time that was accumulated, all those things, you lose all of those details. And so uh, you might have reached new people in that video. And so, I don't advise people deleting entire videos. Uh, yes, you can delete them, it's your, it's your thingy, but for me, I would not advise it. Before, I used to just delete the entire video, but I don't do that nowadays. I just cut the entire video out and then leave a portion so that it can retain the metadata. YouTube uses recommendation on watch time and uh, the video that they watch history uh, that they have. So like a video that they watched on a certain topic to, to create a recommendation. You know, YouTube creates a three-list thingy and whatnot. If you read the algorithm studies and stuff like that, you'll find what I'm talking about. And so you have to find the YouTube manuals, though. So those are a little bit hard. YouTube papers, they're called YouTube papers, algorithm papers. And so you'll, you'll hear the information that I'm talking about. YouTube uses the watch history in order to make a recommendation. And the person, since they've watched your video, they have you in their history. And so I don't delete a video because of that. So it, it leaves that link inside. That's number one. Now I just, I don't hide that I remove a video. I just think I just cut it, change the thumbnail to show that it's not, there's no video anymore. Now, I'm not trying to hide. I saw that there were people that were trying to make a uh, kind of like entire conspiracies. Like we yeah, are the evidence of, Gone is making him. I'm like, since when do you get to dictate a motive? You know, the Bible doesn't. We can't do that. You can't do that. You cannot dictate a motive. That's that's wrong. P straight up. Okay, we can't dictate. There are people that, of course, their motives can become clear. But I just deleted the video I made. I made the video. I removed the video. I didn't even ask the BBC guys. They asked me, Ricky, we try uh, this video. People can't find it. And they kind of get those messages that, hey, the video of the promo is not appearing 
and then I told them, yeah, I, I removed it. And so even they didn't know, okay? I removed the videos myself because I thought, let me not, let me try and take away that audience that's watching and it's creating a narrative towards her. So the woman can mourn her child. Simple. It's nothing deep. There's no evidence that Scorn was releasing that made me delete the videos. You are literally creating. Oh, they decided to, to believe. Don't get off on your high horses, okay? Yeah, I'll relax with that. Now, why am I saying that? It's because uh, Second Timothy chapter number 3, verse number 1 up until 3. In the last days, people, perilous times will come. Uh, men will be lovers of themselves, it says. Highlight that one. Uh, proud, boasters, blasphemers, disobedient to parents, unholy, and uh, unthankful. Then it puts this verse. Without natural affection. Without natural affection. Then the last one it says, despise us of them that do good. So in the last days, people will be, people will be without natural affection. You'll see people without natural affection. And two, haters of them that do good. That period you would literally take out a video showing doctrinally why T.B. Joshua's teaching was wrong. And people will come out hating you that presented a biblical teaching and not realizing the, the wrong. Because they like the, the mandem and whatnot and stuff. And so you are literally, I was literally looking at people that are not willing to accept them that do good, despise us of them that do good. So when you present doctrine, the Bible, remember to, Tim, to, to, to Timothy, Paul says, the one who reminds people of good doctrine shall be highly esteemed. He says, so that you would be a good servant towards the Lord. That's how Paul kind of puts it. That, you know, if uh, watch over your doctrine and them that hear you. You know, and he speaks of this. It's a study so that you will show yourself approved. So if a person has not shown himself to be approved, meaning teaching false doctrine, consciously or whatnot, teaching false doctrine, I spoke about the subject matters of salvation. The man didn't understand salvation. All this. So you were literally seeing people that were despising good teaching to side with the person that was clearly wrong on doctrine. So can you at least acknowledge that? No, they can't. And so, since we are talking about that subject, the area of no, without natural affection didn't shock me. Because you, you, you know where these people come from or the direction they're going. So this was the reason why I removed the videos. These are people that hate good doctrine. You, you, you can't, there's nothing you can say. It wasn't all these motives, oh, he's seen the evidence. I've never cared for anything to, to do with the so-called evidence that Scorn publishes. I've refuted Every single time there was one that came out, I dis dis disputed. I spoke about, I spoke about, I spoke. It was not all of that stuff. But people created a narrative. And I was like, Aibu, where do they do that at? <laughs> Biblically, you're going to create a motive? That's the thing that the Bible warns us. That in the last day, you see people that literally do not have a natural affection. A person loses their child. They won't let the woman rest. So I took down the video so that she can mourn her child. You know, and that was the right decision. I, I wouldn't change thing. YouTube punished me heavily. They killed the recommendations like crazy, <laughs> you know, and, and everything. But you'd rather have that so that another person mourn their child than to have videos up. I, I, I don't, I'm not one of those people that just believe, just keep up. Thing. If there was error, I would have come out and I would have said it. Uh, but there wasn't error in there. The, the videos were just mainly just a representation for what the BBC documentary was going to be about. And so that's why we removed the videos. It's because the woman had lost a child. Simple. No motive. People were painting their own images, their own ideas. None of that. And Basilani, I wanted to remind of that verse because so that we can, we can draw. Basilani, when people start dictating a motive when there isn't any, Okay, we've talked about people who, who there is a motive and you see it. Okay, in that case, it's clear. But for me, I just deleted the video. That's all. 
I said nothing. I just deleted the video. Nothing. So how do you have a motive? And then the motive is that all oh, the evidence is overwhelming. What evidence? Which one? Which one is that one? <laughs> Which evidence are you talking about? And so it was none of that. The Bible doesn't say we can now just come out dictating motives when we don't. You know, you can tell whether a person uh, is either being repentant towards something or not, but a motive, to draw a motive, that's wrong. The Bible say no, no issue there. So I don't know where people do that at. But in the last days, it told you, people will be without natural affection. So they, they don't feel nothing. Woman loses a child, they don't feel nothing. They can pretend they do, you know. And they are hating. On the, they hate on those that teach good doctrine. So if you present a biblical argument, an apology, an apologia, as you might put it, they don't like that. Because that goes contrary to what they have chosen to believe. And so that was the reason why I removed the videos, guys. Nothing deep. People created an entire narrative. But those people, it's unbiblical to create a narrative when there isn't. There's, there's no narrative. There's, there's, it's not more than that. It's just that, let's let the woman mourn. That's it. It's that simple. You, will, you, won't, you won't track. It was not evidence. I've, the release evidence I've re uh, refuted and stuff. But be reminded of that verse, that in the last days you are dealing with this type of people. People that are without natural affection, they love themselves so much that they would hate good when it's presented. And so I thought, let me come out since she's made a video talking about the passing of a child. I haven't watched the video. I'm just telling you about it now because she, if she's talking about it, then I can explain now why. I don't mind people kind of painting me a certain way. For, I don't mind that, you know. Um, I care that I'm presenting the gospel. Uh, I don't care. I don't mind that much. I don't mind that. No, that it doesn't. It doesn't matter, you know. It doesn't mean go out there say all kinds of things, you know. Um, uh, but I don't mind people painting me a certain way, um, which I can later on explain and clarify people on. But be careful yourself finding yourself in a situation where the motive is not established but you create a motive so when i removed the video there was no motive i literally made a video saying the child passed away so one plus one is just simple there is no bigger story he's now in doubt he's regretting where do you get regret where why would i be refuting the other it's people creating a motive that's where creating a motive that's where it's wrong okay there are people where you when you talk about them you can literally see that uh, the motive this is the motive they do this because this is the motive because you go back into what they teach like a pastor or so and so person will teach first fruit teaching and something like that and then when you go back into this teaching of first fruit teaching and then you listen to how they 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 pick up about how much money they want and what, what what so you literally have a motive the person just wants to make money and so that doesn't, that's clear, that's a clear motive. But then when there isn't one, why create one? And so, we'll leave that to people out there. It's Ricky, I thought to make that video now, she made a video explaining about her pass, uh, the passing of her child and everything, and I wanted to come here and give you guys that breakdown. It's Ricky, other episodes down to it down in the pink comments, and y'all have a good one.